was like a big motivator. Hey, <laughs> really got him going. Yeah. <laughs> Lit him back up. Yeah. <laughs> but, all right, so I drive. Do you drive, Josh? Do you have your license or anything like Not that? Not yet. Uh, are you 18 yet? Yeah, I'm 18. Like, I got my permit, like, right when I was 16. But, like, um, I something happened. I don't even honestly remember. Like, but when we got to the DMV, they said, like, uh, that... Like, when I wanted to take my driving test, like, we got there, like, like 10 minutes too late. And they're like, oh, like, your spot's already been filled. You can't do it. Uh, like, we're like, we're not going to wait here. Like, fuck that. Yeah. And so we dip. And then, like, um, by the time we went to go schedule another driver's appointment, my permit expired. Because my mom made me wait, like, forever. Uh. And so, like, honestly, like, it's just been bad, really bad timing. Especially because we have the baby now. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Like, so, like, it's rough with her. Kid? Huh? You got a kid? No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> low key, low key, maybe. <laughs> the, I honestly, one thing I wish I would have known when I was doing my permit is that I wish I would have known that my permit picture was gonna be on my ID license oh. because you they know, didn't let I, you retake it. Uh, no, I never, I never even got the chance to retake it. They just, <laughs> when I got my license, they just said, "Yep, here's your fake license. You'll get it in like a couple weeks." And I didn't even know I got um. my my like fifteen year old like <laughs> my fifteen year old long hair, and it's just like, is that still your license picture? Yeah, it's still my license picture. Dude, I, I haven't, I haven't even had my license for a year yet. But honestly, I think I got, I think I got blessed when I took my driver's test because I get in there, Perfect I came timing. all early. Next thing you know, boom, power shuts out. Oh. Gone. Everything's down. So I'm just sitting there like, man, I'm really gonna have to miss my whole day of school for this. <laughs> oh, damn. I don't. I don't want to be standing. I'm like second in line, bro. Come on. That and sucks. then they finally started to get up after I think like 15, 20 minutes and just standing there. And, and like, I get in there and I my my like I'm driving my car around to take the test. Yeah. And next thing you know, I get like this big old fool. He looks like he's a Albert Einstein scientist. <laughs> long old beard to his belly. And like he gets in, and then I swear I thought I failed so quick because I I think I was driving for like two to three minutes max, and like I get in there and he makes me park in like a handicap section, yeah. and he just looks at me, he like he just turns, and I'm like, you passed. <laughs> I was like, oh for sure. <laughs> and I look at the paper, I only had made like one mistake. I That's tight. I, don't, I didn't make a lot of mistakes either. I don't understand how people can like if you're practicing driving, how you can like yeah. mess up so many times. You just gotta be yeah, stupid. You try to practice, honestly. It really just only takes practice. I, I honestly like when I'm like next to like those big rigs on the freeway or something, I get hella anxiety. Yeah, like, that, that like, scares like, oh. me all the time, yeah. especially if it's on my right side because I like to sit low in my car. I like yeah, and I, I can't even see the hood of my car, but I just know where it's at. <laughs> but I, like I can feel it, especially when there's a car next to me, and then there's the big rig, and it's like, yeah. it's, it's I just I'm not sometimes be speeding to get around them. Yeah, for real, freaky. <laughs> would know, you Would you like take them. your driving test at? Uh, I took mine in. I got my permit and my license at Norco. At Norco, yeah. Yeah. At Norco. Everybody was stressing me out. They're like, nobody passes first time at Norco. I'm like, y'all are stupid. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna yeah, pass. Bro, yeah. Says the person <laughs> that didn't pass the first time. I really yeah, sad, right? I'm saying, <laughs> yeah. They all say there's like one driving teach, driving instructor that like always fails everybody on their first time, no matter what. Yeah, I mean, I was in like, I didn't want to know who he was because I wanted impressive. <laughs> <laughs> I got this like this really cool like. Like, this, like, kind of, like, old lady. She was pretty cool. But, like, the same thing happened to me, too. I, like, parked and stuff. And I, I looked at her. And I was like, I like, did I pass? She was like, yes, you just passed me. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, cool. <laughs> I, th I think I did see that lady right after I was walking in to uh, get my paperwork. Yeah? Yeah. She, little, she, little she, looks, she looked happy. Yeah, she's a little sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, what car do you drive, Gavin? Oh, boy. I got my little <laughs> white lightning, little Ford, Ford Ranger, little stick shift. Hey, yeah. stick shift? <laughs> yeah, sir. Is there in the <laughs> trunk two-seater? Yeah, only two. You have only two seats. <laughs> yeah. I think. It can be three seats only sometimes, though. <laughs> yeah, that thing was a hand-me-down over a hand-me-down, though. That sucked. Damn, for real? I didn't even know that. Yeah, it was, it was like, it was from my, my dad's company, and then it was went from my dad's company to my brother, and then to my brother to me. Mm, so that I thing's see. been worked a lot. There's been, I mean, so many things. I don't even know. That thing's just a work, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it has a leak right now. Like, I can't drive it right now. I took uh, my dad's car. <laughs> you be whipping it, though? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I be whipping hell in that thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting that thing useful. I'm, I'm the last driver. I'm trying to make that. <laughs> <laughs> you, got, you got any crazy stories from whipping it too hard? Um, Honestly, no. I mean, I just, like, just casual donuts and stuff. But that's about it. <laughs> but, I mean... My 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 friend's car though, on the other hand, I mean we were in his his car 
And he had, kind of has like the same car as a Tacoma, I think. It was like a 2002 one. But we were very, coming very home from car. Very different truck. <laughs> well, I mean, like, it's still a truck, though. But, yeah. like, it still had the two seats and stuff or whatever. But, um, so oh, where, where were we coming from? I remember this. Yeah, we were, we were coming from uh, from football practice. We were done and stuff. And since we only had two seats, we usually, like, drive down to our locker room. And, like, we were, like, we were part, like, we, re- we went to our cars. Or we went to his car. And we went and we... We sat down in like in the car, and we told his fr- our friend to uh, sit in the trunk. And he looked at me, Zach, or Zach, our homie, looked at me, the owner of the car, looked at me, he's like, "Should I give him the special?" <laughs> and I looked at him, and I was like, "Yep, I was like, hell yeah, you should give him the special." So we were just being dumbasses. Oh my god, we we're being so dumbasses. And he like pulled out, and he like just floored it and just skirted, and like we were coming around the corner, and we we're whipping that thing, and we just started to like. We started to skirt. We're like, <laughs> we, were like we were like this. I remember looking at him, and like he was like twisting it. Then I like turned this way, and then he got stuck. And we we're going s- straight to a fence, like <sighs> straight to a fence that led to a, like a big ass like fifteen like foot drop to like the sewers <laughs> right by the, the the FPK room. Yeah, it was um, like a, a sewage pipe, like yeah, a sewage yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, so we we hit the fence. Luckily, that fence was right there. We <laughs> hit that fence. We like got cushion from it, and then we like totally freaking like. Like just was was sideways on that sewer thing, and we like I remember like I looked at Zach and Zach looked at me and I was like in a spider position like at the window and he was just like sideways looking at me and then I was and he was like you good I was like yeah bro I was like bro like, Logan so like I I rolled like we like the windows are cracked and stuff so like I like, hopped out of the window and I looked at Logan and I saw like his like foot was like bleeding like like shit was bleeding and I was like. I was like, oh my god! I was like, what the fuck? So I just like freaked out, like hopped out. I took off my sock and I wrapped it around his shin for like to cover the blood and stuff. And like at the time, the the ducks, the football ducks, yeah, the the little kids like like oh, team yeah, over there. Yeah, they the came, they came over here. Yeah, they came over here. Uh, like, came over to the thing and like it was like, what the fuck? And like it was just crazy. <laughs> what happened? What happened to Logan's leg? It was just like cut open, I guess. That's all that happened, though. Yeah, we. Well, I didn't even say like, bro. He was in the back of the car, in the back of the car, like in the bed of the truck. Yes, in the bed of the <laughs> truck, and we did just all that, on. and like he only got a cut on his shin. He didn't get like thrown or anything. Nah. Yeah, dude. That that's, man, that's, that man just was like, like Patrick Star, just on <laughs> all the walls, bro. <laughs> he, really, he told me he was like that. He like was like that, and then like he like legit like perfect. Like he t- said, he like he timed it perfectly and jumped out like I, like <laughs> sideways. I was like, dude, that's <laughs> nuts. Like, that's crazy. He's just he's preparing. All this so this is what he's been weightlifting for his whole life. Yeah. He's to do this one stuff. Yeah, was, his game gnarly. season, baby. Yeah, that, <laughs> it was gnarly. Oh, man. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not trying to do anything crazy like that with my car. <laughs> yeah, that like, was stupid. Especially, yeah, I got like, I got a little fast sport mode on my car. <laughs> so, you know, I'm, mode. I'm, not, I'm not trying <laughs> to risk it, you know. <laughs> you know, I'm not trying to, I'm trying to take care of this car. Keep it as long as I got, to be honest. That's funny. Josh, you're, you're <laughs> turn- Josh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you got you got any uh, crazy experiences with some cars? I know uh, I know your girl will be whipping it around a little bit. Yo, actually, not any with her. She's like I don't know. She's not too bad at driving. Actually, she can speed sometimes. And, like she doesn't know how to slow down for a stoplight. So like, <laughs> this is like the beginning of the intersection. She just like like halfway into the intersection every time. Like, what are you doing? Um, <laughs> Now, actually, I've been in, like, three car accidents. Like, like none of them were, like, major car accidents. They were all, like, kind of, like, stupid. Like, two of them were fender benders. Mm-hmm. And then uh, another one, my homie, like, was going left on a, a left a left, <laughs> left turn. <laughs> left turn, turn. <laughs> you got it. Left turn signal. I don't even fucking know, bro. <laughs> he was supposed to, he wasn't supposed to turn yet, and he turned. And then a car came zooming by, and it hit the front of his truck. Or his, his Jeep. Gavin was in the car, too, actually. Uh, <laughs> was? Yeah, dude. Dude, he, he doesn't <laughs> well, even... How do you know? No, nah, dude, he doesn't even remember. That That was actually a crazy story, kind of. Um, So, like, the guy that hit us, like, he was, like... Uh, he pulled back up, like... Because we pulled off to the side. And he was, like, yo, what the fuck? Like, why'd you guys, like, go? Like, it was, like, you were <gasps> supposed to yield. Oh! And you remember. You re- he remembers. Oh Bro, and, like, gosh. he pulls up. And, like, he's, like, hold on, hold on. My mom's in the car. I can't be here right now. He leaves in one car, the car he crashed in, right? He leaves, goes God knows where. He comes back like 10 minutes later. He like, before he in left, a different he was like, car. yeah, he was like, wait here, wait here. He uh. left in a different car and he brought back his homeboy, right? And like, 
Like, he comes up hot as fuck. And, like, he's like, yo, like, to my homie, he was like, give me your license. Give me your license. Like, the one who got yeah. in the accident. Mm -hmm. He was like, what's wrong with you? Why would you do that? Give me your license. Like, he's like, no, like, what, like, give me your license. Like, let me see your shit first. Like, I'm not just going to give you my stuff. Like, you're pressing me, bro. Like, like this yeah. is supposed to be an equal exchange. Like, he's like, no, just give it to me. Give it to me right now. Like, blah, blah, blah. And then um, Justin finally gives it to him. He's like, okay, I'm going to go grab my stuff. And he parked, like, in the uh, store parking lot, like, right across the street. Mm -hmm. And then he starts walking back to his car. And, like, his homie was just, like, waiting, like, right outside the car. And then, like, there's, like, a little brick wall. He hops over it. And then, like, we watch him. And we're like, yo, like, we should probably follow him. Like, yeah. he starts, like, running. He didn't even look, <laughs> he, he didn't even look back yeah. to see we were going after him. He just starts running, bro. Takes off. Like, gets in the car, dips. We don't know where he went. <laughs> yeah, but I remember, no, I remember me, Luna, and uh, I forgot who else. We, like, all saw him running. We're like, yeah, dude, they saw him looking after him. Like, what? Bro, what <laughs> like, what's <laughs> going on right now? And, like, we, like, saw him dipping. He, like, started skirting. We, like, we, like we're dipping. Like, we're going past, like, I feel like we're, like, in an action movie. Like, we're, like, going <laughs> past, like, like the stores and stuff. Like, people are coming yeah. out of the stores. We're, like, watch out, watch out. And Bro, we're trying it to get crazy. It. Yeah, it was crazy. There was no reason for it either. Like, what are you going to do with somebody's license? Yeah, like, I know. Like, we're, like, why did he take, like, like your there was license? No, there was no <laughs> point to it. Yeah. Did, he get yeah. a, what, did he get like, away with it? Yeah, yeah, he just, he he just, just fucking did, yeah. bro. We never he like he skirted the fuck like, out of dip. there. Like he went behind the store, like behind the store, like where they like drop off like the food and stuff. Never he came was back. Dipping. Justin's license was gone. I felt bad. We came what? back and Justin was like, "Did you get it?" <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so I just after that, I just had no license. Yeah, yeah, he had to order a new yeah, one yeah, and everything. New one. <laughs> he was like, I'm going to have phone call. He's like, yeah, someone stole my license. Like, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that's, I've never had nothing like that. Like, no, it didn't. Um, it was Manny and Chloe pulled up with John. Yeah. And then John was one of the other ones that chased yes. after him, too. Yeah, that was crazy. <laughs> hey, rest in peace to homie John. R.P. John. That's a homie. RP John. I don't know if you guys really want to talk about that whole scenario or not with John. I mean, I mean he's too sensitive. <laughs> I mean, it's I, no, it's it's like I mean, like he he was closer to him than I was, so like. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that was a boy. I mean, RP to him, but it was just like he got. It was after Angels game and stuff, and he got like in a car accident on the ninety one. Yeah. Yeah. It, it was tough. It's all right though. I mean, I mean, he's over like the world can't handle him. So I mean. He became an angel and stuff. Now he's looking over all the homies and stuff. So I know he's here with us. So. Yeah, I feel. I feel like a lot of homies get a lot of motivation from. Oh yeah, remembering John. Yeah. Oh yeah, exactly. Dude, my man, like seriously, like he, was, he, bro, he was, like the world was in his hands. Seriously, yeah, he had so much potential. Like, like he was just so good at anything he did. For Football, real. like he was so like weightlifting. Like he was so smart, bro. Yeah. Like people who know him know, like nah, yeah, he was a he was that dude. Like he was the one always that was, taking like honors classes. Yeah, AP. exactly. He was like, and he was like doing this like stuff with the struggle too. Like he had some struggles going on, and he was just being a man about it. Like he was, like, I looked up to him. I still do look up. He to worked him. a windowing job on top of school. Yeah, like exactly. he, like he would get around anywhere bro like it was yeah. amazing like seriously like if he needed to get down to the beach he'd get down to the beach take the train take the bus whatever like means 12 at night walk too. like yeah dude do seriously like he he'd disappear you'd see him post on his story at 5 a.m yeah. like at the beach and we're like what the hell are you doing <laughs> he'd be like he'll call me at like two in the morning and be like yo he's like, what are you doing <laughs> i'm like bro like what do you mean like i'm just at his house like doing what we usually be doing <laughs> But uh, he'd be like, "Dude, come pick me up. I'm at the train station." Like, <laughs> yeah, like, dude. What? No, I'm like, "All right." <laughs> Always man. got calls about that. Yeah, bro. seriously. <laughs> yeah, I wish I would have got to know John Moore. I I only really knew him or knew him. <laughs> <laughs> I only really knew him like uh, freshman and sophomore year when I was playing, or more mostly sophomore year when I started like getting to know you guys better. Yeah, yeah. But I didn't. I didn't. Uh, it's, I wish I would have uh, got to know him better because I already felt like I knew him pretty good just with the short, short amount of time that bro, I that's hung all out with that's him. That's the way John was, bro. Yeah. He, was like, he, was, bro. he was really open with everybody. He was just such a cool dude. Yeah, yeah he really was. Awesome. We connected through football and also like skateboard. I, uh, John, dude, I remember John loved He got skateboard. everybody in the skateboarding, bro. He got everybody in the Honestly, skateboarding. Yeah, bro, like, Hell yeah, he did. Really? Yeah. He, he got you into skateboarding? Oh, yeah. He got, he got, we, we, we had a cool, cool minute. Yeah, a time where we were just like skating every single day after school, just like, like outside, right outside like, Ains apartment. Yeah, ate, like Gavin Parkage truck, we'd all just post up in the back of it, like and like we'd all just be skating right there in the street of yeah. Ains apartment complex, bro. 
Yeah. We're all getting yeah. good at it too, low key. We're all becoming like a little little squad. Nah, <laughs> I'm still trash. I can only ollie. Uh, yeah, did you start? Did you try to get into skating, Josh? I I tried you to. Into I didn't. It, though. I That's didn't all that counts. I didn't have a board like at first, and then um I got one and like. Uh, I didn't. Or no, no, no. I didn't have. I had a board, but I didn't have trucks. And then I got trucks. Uh huh. And then like I, I kind of started skating, but like I couldn't pick it up as fast. And like I didn't really do it as much because I wasn't as good. And yeah. then like I, I kind of started to pick it up actually like during the beginning of quarantine because there was like jack shit to do. Yeah. And then like I got good at the ollie, and then like I started working on the pop shove it, and then like I <laughs> that was it. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys, you guys got into like skateboarding just by like with your homie. He said like, hey, let's yeah. just go skateboarding. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, honestly, it wasn't even like that. Like we literally, well, I mean, like, there was a period in time where we like we were over at over at our one homie's house like every single day, oh, yeah. just hanging out, like having a good time, and like we'd like whenever we'd go over there, like we'd just be chilling inside, like either like watching YouTube videos, listening to music, like playing Smash. Yeah, exactly. Like, Smash and then, like, Bros. Was yeah. Smash Bros. Yeah. goes crazy. Yeah, yeah, dude, there'd be like, there'd be like everybody skateboard, like four of them lined out right outside the apartment door because he had like a really small place. Mm-hmm. And then like, somebody would be like, I'm gonna go skate. And then yeah. it'd be like, all right, I'm gonna come too. John would be like, yeah. let's go skate. And then like everybody would just like slowly get up, put on their shoes and go out there, yeah. bro. That's sick. I, I remember when I first started skating. Yeah, didn't you used to skate out front of you and stuff? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, I I grew up uh, in my eighth grade year. I wanted to learn how to skate because when I was like super young, my my brother, my older brother, uh, he skated like so much all the time in our house, and he got really good at it with like skating like ramps and bowls and stuff. He mm. actually uh, is friends with like a a couple like professional skaters. I don't know if you know a guy by the name of Billy Marks. Mm. Uh, yeah, I, I have don't know. A, I have a couple. Yeah, he's a. Do you know the brand uh, Toy Machine? Yeah, yeah, he's sponsored by them. Like, oh, that's he has tight. His own that's and Stuff like there, uh, but he grew up like skating with my brother, and then my brother tried to get it to me, like skateboarding at a young age, which I wish I would have done when I was so much younger. But I just wanted to play video games and you know become MLG with it, make money <laughs> yeah. off of this. But that didn't work out. But uh, I got back into it like my eighth grade year. I really wanted to do it because I was playing football. And my team was losing every game, and I was like, I was on the, I was a hey, big boy at the time, you know. I was, I was lineman. I was doing so much work. I was getting beat up every day in practice. It just sucked, and like, I wanted to learn how to skate. So I literally told all my friends, I was like, bro, after my football season's done, I'm gonna be a skater. I'm gonna learn how to do this. I swear. So I, my eighth grade year season ended. It was like winter time. I swear it took me like. I did not want to skate with anybody. I wanted to skate by myself and learn how to do it and just come out like Tony Hawk yeah, out of like nowhere. It, yeah. <laughs> it took me like eight months to learn how to ollie like properly while rolling somewhat with somewhat yeah. speed. And then like I finally met some skate friends. And then uh, I, I wish I could go back to the days where like me and my friends, we didn't have yeah. any cars. And I would just like get dropped off at their house and just skate all throughout the city and yeah. just s- spend most of the day just riding your board and yeah, sure. surfers club baby. <laughs> oh yeah, I See, wish I did that, bro. Uh, it, I actually grew up with like a completely different group of friends that I skated with with the ones I have now. But it's crazy because they ended up like skating a uh, school or skating around the neighborhood that was like closer to than my yeah. other friends. Mm-hmm. But like, uh, I would just be skating around in the streets. And I miss it because we all really yeah. wanted to be like really good, and we were trying to learn stuff like every day. And now it's not it's not the same, you know. You go to a skate park, you can try a couple of tricks, but everybody's kind of yeah. just like chilling there. Just yeah, like, I like street though better, fun. honestly. I like still, street. So talk to those homies, your skate homies. Yeah, I actually just went to the skate park today. I said what's up to all the homies. Not all of them were there. Saw some new people, but That's like. So sad. Uh, do you know you know uh, the homie Jacob Farmer? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. love Jacob Farmer. I be I be seeing him all the time at, uh, at the skate park. So I, you know it's cool to see him. He's Santana and stuff. Yeah, yeah, he's a Santana low. He's one of the guys that used to skate up the street like yeah, at the yeah. part of you with us. One of the locals, yeah. part of you gang. <laughs> <laughs> that that fool still shreds too. That's the crazy part. Like they brought like. They brought, I swear, out of nowhere, I was just, like, looking at my phone, and I look up, say what's up to Jacob, I look back at my phone, and I look into the skate park, and they have, like, a dishwasher, like, <laughs> tipped on its side to try skate and do tricks it? over yeah, it, tricks that's on it. Dude, that, I'm like, what is going on here? That's, that's what's dope. so cool about skating to me, is, like, you can literally go anywhere and, like, just skate anything. Happen. Yeah, seriously, like, find, like, people be skating trash cans, like, yeah, fucking washers, bro, <laughs> like, <laughs> shit. Like that's that's so cool. To me. Be, he, that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, you yeah. can really do anything with anything. So, yeah. So like, I wanted to ask since like you you didn't get into skating as much. How do you like 
if you ever like see like a clip of like somebody doing like a crazy like trick how does how do you think like what do you think about when you see that like do you think it's like oh that's the best thing in the world that's crazy or it's like mm, i like uh, i mean like it depends like i mean i i know like i don't know like a lot of skateboard tricks but like it's like i used to watch like skate videos like and shit so like I mean, like, it's not like, well, that's like, like if I know, like, it's like a hard ass trick, I'll be like, damn, like, that's just tight, but I don't <laughs> <Yeah>. know. <laughs> it just does a lot of spins and stuff. That's probably cool cool ass shit. Nah, because for me, it's different because I've skated for so long. Yeah, that yeah, I'll, it probably I'll, is. I'll, I'll go into, like, skate videos and I'll, I'll I'll watch them differently, I feel like, from other people because I'll be, like, dissecting the trick they're doing. And yeah. I, I feel like I can appreciate yeah. it more for what they're doing because I can, I understand. I'm at that level where, like, I can understand what they're doing yeah. and the difficulty of it. And also, man, this changed my life on, like, looking at everything. Like, I could look at this table right here that we're sitting on and I'd be like, man, I wonder what trick I could do off of this. So, <laughs> I'm looking at, I'm looking at, I'm, a, saying, I'm looking you know? at simple, like, stairs that are, like, just, like, yeah. made for walking in, like, easy <laughs> transportation. I'm like, man, it looks so sick. If I did, like, a kickflip <laughs> off of this, then I did a trick. I did that. Yeah, <laughs> Set like, up your phone. I feel like skateboarding changed my, changed my life, my perspective on things. That's dope. I, I like skateboarding. Skateboarding's always fun. Do you still skate or nah? I mean, not really. Not right now, honestly, because I've just I have school and stuff and work. Yeah, I've been like lacking on it. I, I always like, I always like, I always like pick up my board and stuff or something, like just go cruising around the street or something. That's why I like doing just like surfing and cruising. Yeah, that's that's my favorite thing to do too. Yeah. Best I, like, especially when I go to the beach, I love to like just go on the like sidewalks and everything. Yeah, bro, and just cruise. Yeah. I want to do that with like a longboard. I used to have one. But I don't. I don't remember what happened to it. I'm trying to get like the longboard wheels for my skateboard because then it's just like smooth, yeah. you yeah, know. Fact. You ever see those one people with the like skate like the long like longboards that are like for balancing like doing? Oh like, yeah, they like oh, they yeah, do, they do, they do, they do like dances like, on the board. Yeah, that, Bro, that was crazy, nah, dude. There's some videos where like they like. They do like no complies, but with like a whole yeah. ass longboard. Yeah, like tip it and they like flip yeah. it with Dude, their like, hands. Dude, like there's like a yeah. whole bunch of flips in the air. It's fucking crazy. It's yeah, so that, cool. that's yeah. nuts. I know this looks sick. I wish I could do that, but like I've gotten on those longboards that are like bouncy like that, and it's yeah. they're scary to it's, ride. Yeah, because like, like it, it just gives, <laughs> yeah, it just gives in the middle, huh? <laughs> yeah, it gives in the middle and it bends, but it, it, you're not gonna touch the floor. You're yeah. not gonna like get like caught on anything because there's like grooves for the wheels and stuff like mm -hmm. that. But it's like you like. Can, like bounce <laughs> on it, and I, I'm, I'm just like thinking about it while I'm riding it. Like all these people are doing like 360s, their <laughs> yeah, body, seriously. and they're just like I'm making it look like easy. Like, I feel like I'm gonna break that simple, shit. Honestly, but imagine being able to do that, just like walking like down the street and just like busting that trick <laughs> yeah, out real like, quick. <laughs> just perfectly like just imagine you're just like riding this to work. Like you have like a, a nine to five business job at a computer, and you have to wear like a suit or something. And you're, just, <laughs> you're just cruising down, <laughs> and like that and shit, then like bro. you decide. It's like you're in a commercial. Decide to put your headphones on. Yeah. Man, yeah. just start going crazy. <laughs> yeah, but everybody's, just, everybody's just creating a path like with <laughs> like a Noah's Ark and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Jesus. <laughs> but, but I love skateboarding. Josh, I feel like you should get back into skateboarding. I'm not, I'm not saying you should. I have a board. Uh, like um, I used to have a Biggie Smalls board. Biggie like, Smalls. Yeah, That's what I was, it was like It was like an 825. Like and like um, my, my homie, he took it from me for some reason. I think I left it in his car and he just took it and like he took my trucks off of it and my wheels, and now they're his, apparently. So <laughs> that's, uh, that's what happened to my brother. <laughs> yeah. So, like, like oh, I mean, I still talk to him. I could probably take him back to skateboards at my house, actually. So, uh, nah, but, um, yeah, he took him, and then he was like, your board's broken. And then. So oh, I, sweet. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, for real. And then he, uh, I had to take uh, one of our other homie, uh, Aiden's uh, skateboard, and it was, like, a girl board. Mm -hmm. And it's, like, super fucking small. And, like, <laughs> I'm not. I, it's, it's, like. I hate small boards. Yeah, I can do like ollie on it. And, like, I just want a bigger board. Like, it doesn't feel like, feels like I'm like struggling to do tricks on that board. Like, my feet barely fit on it. Yeah. Do you wait? You're taller than me. How tall are you, Gavin? I'm like six two, six two. Six two, man. I'm like five eight, man. I'm like <laughs> five eleven in like three quarters. Three quarters. Son. Three quarters. Three quarters. If, we're, if we're getting technical, bro. All that counts. That's how you know he's been paying attention. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be six foot. <laughs> All right, guys, so I know uh, this pandemic has been really hard on everybody. A lot yeah. of people have been getting laid off, like, without their own will or anything like that and having to do, like, this unemployment money. I just want to know uh, what, like, your guys' family has been going through during this time. Have they been laid off or anything like that? Well, I mean, they're, like, my dad hasn't been laid off, but, like, he's just, like, I can tell that like, he's just been really stressed and stuff. Like, I can tell, like, he's just, like, 
just like it's just really tough right now. Obviously, cause it's a pandemic and stuff, and it's like it's like infecting like anything or everything. But uh, my mom, like, she just got her job actually like this week. So I mean, I mean, it, it's just tough right now. That's all it really is, honestly. Yeah. Um. Yeah. This pandemic's been kind of rough. Like, uh, my dad. Uh, he uh, he works from home right now. Like he had a job over at uh, Toshiba in Irvine, but um, I think it was like my sophomore year. He he got put into uh, working from home, and so like he was working like forty hour weeks, and then they cut his hours in half to like twenty hours because of COVID, which is like really like hard for us, especially right now because um, my mom doesn't have a job because where she worked at is like kind of like closed. Like, it closed down for the mm-hmm. first wave, and, like, she didn't have a job. And then, like, everything started to open up again at that one point. And, like, uh, and she got her job back. They called her back. They're like, you can come work for a little bit. And then the second wave hit, and then now she's still out of a job. But Where's she work at? Uh, TGI Fridays. Oh, okay. yeah. Like, she's a bartender, right? Yeah, yeah. bartender. Nah, but, hey, yeah. You know that. Huh? Yeah, I've been friends with Josh. <laughs> you, know my, you know my mom's name, right? Shaniqua, Shaniqua. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I remember, you, I remember you saying that because we were at the competition and you like looked at your little sister, <laughs> and I thought it was your little sister's name. And yes. then you, but you called it Preston. You're like, Shaniqua, get your kid. <laughs> yeah, dude, I swear, nobody believes me. Like I remember in elementary school, like back when, like when I first got my phone, like maybe like fourth grade, I had like a little flip phone. My mom got me, like, um, like they'd be like, like what's your mom's name? Be like Shaniqua, and they'd be like. No, what's your mom's yeah. name? I'm like that is my mom's name. Like, I like seriously have to call her. She's like at work. She's like, what is this, sweetie? I'm like, what's your name? Like, what's your <laughs> name? <laughs> She's like, Shaniqua. They're like, you're lying. <laughs> it's funny, bro. I I feel like uh with this whole un- unemployment thing, I I honestly think even though it's gone down a little bit, you know, I was like more money before than it is now. Yeah, I feel like people are like. Getting these checks are never gonna want to work again. Uh, well, right, as of right now, they're not gonna want to work again in the future. Cause why would you work when you can get just dude, enough money to survive dude, off dude, of? Dude, for nah, free. But like, nah. but now that like if people think like that, man, the world's not free, man. Well, you I mean, got, I'm, saying, I'm saying, I'm saying like the, the older people are being more comfortable with it because they don't have oh, to work yeah. and they can get this income and all I that. Mean, yeah, even for like even younger people that can get used it. to it though. Yeah, e- even can. some of this generation though, like. I've, like, uh, had a talk with, like, somebody. I'm not going to name names because, like, it's probably not good to. Like, <laughs> never, yeah, like, he, he, um, he he's filing for unemployment right now. Mm-hmm. Uh, and, like, he was, like, trying to make the argument the other night that was, like, uh, it was like, why why would you work a job? Like, I can get you, like, six grand in your pocket right now. Like, you can, like, still have your job, actually. Like, I can still get you unemployment. Like, that's fraud, bro. Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like that's coming by you now somehow. Like, yeah, like for real, like I don't know. It was just like my homie was saying back to him, like I'm not just gonna like not work for my money, like, like I, I, I mean he has a job, like like our friend was saying, like quit your job, like six grand in your pocket right now, like type shit, like you know what I mean? Yeah. And like he, like it was just kind of like a stupid argument. It's like don't 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 get too comfortable living off that money, like yeah, because like soon enough it's gonna be gone yeah. and. You're going to be on your own, like, on your ass, not knowing what to do. Yeah, I just feel like some people are getting getting used to it and all that. The people that are not really, like, people that are just, ma- like, there to, like, make it through, not to, yeah. like, be the best they can be, you exactly. know, just trying yeah. to survive, I guess, <laughs> for the time being, you know. Yeah. It just doesn't make sense, bro. Like, why would you want to live life like that? Yeah. Uh, well, would you rather? Would you rather, like, have this, like, easy check come in for you, like, regularly or would you want to like have to start at zero and then be able to like make your money like oh no slowly dude, slowly dude, like start from zero and yeah. make my way up yeah like, I, I, feel gotta, like I, gotta, I gotta have some self self-discipline stuff yeah, like, like i feel like there's like stuff. yeah there's a sense of pride that comes yeah. with like starting from nothing and working your way up yeah. and like that's probably one of the things like a lot of like successful people like 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 to boast about is like they started from nothing and they got yeah, exactly. all the way to the top like Easy. from nothing like, yeah. it, it get, dude like that I, I, get it, it. Yeah. <laughs> I get it though like anybody can become a millionaire you just got to be smart you got to be frugal you gotta you gotta i don't know i don't know you what you gotta, gotta do i'm not a millionaire <laughs> you, just gotta know you, have to, you just gotta know that you can do it yeah, yeah. exactly you gotta be open i be open with it you got any funny broke stories like like kind of like what i was talking about celebrities or like shit you went to the atm like you're trying to pay something you got to decline or um, messed up I mean, 
Uh, I mean, usually when I, when I don't have money, I just don't do it. Like, I just don't spend <laughs> it. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Good model. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, a couple times on, a, on my bank account, like, I'll order shit online. And, like, one time I ordered something for, like, 90 bucks, bro. <laughs> 90 bucks. And, like... For ninety, <laughs> no, 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 that's not the point. That's not. The point. I'm just saying that. I'm saying that because, like, for some odd reason, I checked my bank account. Like, then, like, within like a couple of days, or like maybe like a like a, the week that it was supposed to like get shipped to me, like that it was supposed to arrive. I checked my bank account, and like all the money was back in my account, and like I was like, what? Like, what the hell? <laughs> like, and I was just, I was just tripping out on it. I was like, why? Why do I have ninety dollars still in my account? And like. I checked the checked the shipping. It was still on its way, and I was like, "Did I just did I just get my money back?" And, I, <laughs> and like, I was just tripping out, bro. And then low key, I spent some of that money, and that was my downfall, bro. The, it, the money got taken out of my account again, and I was like negative fifty dollars in my bank account, bro. I was like, "Fuck." <laughs> it was kind of funny. Bro. Yeah, it, it was it was not fun. I've done that like twice. <laughs> you, you you would have thought I would learn from the first time. Yes. <laughs> I've never had that Bro, happen to me. I don't know where to stuff. Have you have you ever been scammed no. on the internet? No, no, I haven't. You've been scammed? <laughs> You've been scammed? Dude, nah, I okay. Listen, I was trying to get a hoodie off Twitter. <laughs> Oh my dude, God. but not nah, it looked legit. Like I thought it was It legit. looked legit. <laughs> it wasn't legit. That's all I gotta say. I was so mad. Like I was so it was a gift too for like my girlfriend. Like it was supposed to be uh, I think like a birthday gift or a Christmas gift. I can't remember for what. <laughs> Fucking like dead serious. Like like I sent him like fifty dollars. I should I should have knew it was a you scam when he asked for my cash app. Bro. <laughs> you sent him fifty bucks. Yeah, it's because I I thought he was getting. Oh, obviously I'm gonna send him the money before I order something. But I, dude, like a bunch of people like were like commenting under it, like saying that they ordered shit. So like that's why I was like, oh, okay. Like those are all of his homies. <laughs> no, dude, all of them got Straight scammed. Up. All of them got scammed yeah. too, bro. Like people started posting <laughs> about it like two months after, yeah. and they're like, what the f, bro? Like where's my shit? Don't trust this dude. <laughs> yeah, I never got it, bro. That's so R.I.P. Was that at least like was it a dope hoodie at least? No, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's all right, it was man. just a plain hoodie. That's all right, it's like I don't know, the, 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 the no, no 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 the only the only special thing about it is that there was like it was like lined with satin on the inside like you know that fabric it's like really soft. Oh yeah yeah. Right. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah I, I, I don't know. I don't, be buying, I don't be. I don't be buying. <laughs> like you know. Oh, dude! I just seen it. I was like, oh, okay, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Spend a quick fifty on nothing. Hey, we don't talk about that no more. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not too proud of my my decision making. I don't, I don't really trust online buying stuff online, especially if it's clothes. Yeah, I don't. I do. That was like the first time like I ever bought like something like on or not like like a jacket. Like I don't usually buy shit or clothes online. Like I usually go into stores. <laughs> like I mean I've ordered stuff on order stuff online like items but like I did like for active and stuff. that's what I did like online I ordered my stuff from active yeah that's in, that's used unfortunate to. Used to. that is unfortunate. <laughs> Who, who orders stuff off of Twitter, bro? Bro, <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I don't want to talk about this. Anymore. Can we, Gavin? <laughs> what kind of what what you, what you got going on? Nothing. I'm not, I'm not dumb enough to get scammed by guys. <laughs> yeah. <that's it. laughs> Oh, I'm oh, not on Twitter. Oh, my bad. <laughs> it's getting a little hot in here. <laughs> Under pressure, too much. Pressure. I know. This is a lot of pressure. <laughs> All right. Well, if we don't got anything else, I uh, appreciate you guys for coming over. Yeah, yeah first oh, yeah, time yeah, for having yeah, me. This shit was tight as fuck. Yeah, this is awesome. This is Honestly. dope. Hopefully, you know, we get this big. Maybe yeah. you got. I don't know. Maybe I'll see you guys back again sometime on this podcast. I, yeah. I, I, I want to come back. Bro. I want to yeah, see, see the, the progress. See yeah, if we'll, you guys. We'll are come here. back in a month and we'll see how the show is yeah. going. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see how you guys progress. What day is it? What day is it? It's the it's the fifteenth. We coming we coming back October fifteenth. October fifteenth. Right. We're seeing we're seeing the progress. That's All right, thank you to my boy Josh Robert. That's how you say your last name, right? Robert. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and my boy Gavin Sheffield. Thank you. Thank it's been you. the Appreciate Prodigy it. Podcast. A pleasure. Signing out. Goodbye.